Hey guys, Chris with Phone Arena here at MWC 2015. Right now I'm at Fujitsu's booth checking out a new concept they have for smartphones, uh, which is iris scanning actually. Uh, it's supposed to be more secure and faster uh, than conventional fingerprint scanners. Uh, and I'm just going to run through the setup and show you how it works. Uh, it actually uses an uh, infrared uh, LED flash and an infrared camera, uh, but on this demo unit ha here we have uh, an extra bolt on, bolted on the phone, uh, but when the device is ready, uh, when the scanner is ready for commercial use uh, sometime in uh, between uh, April this year and April 2016, uh, it's going to be actually integrated with uh, your front-facing camera, so it's not going to add any bulk or any weight from what we are told. So just a quick demo to show you of how it works. I'm just going to unlock this phone here. I'm going to run the uh, setup. We just click here. So right now I'm just going to run you through the uh, initial setup. It's going to take a little, uh, a little lo longer than you usually need to, uh, to open it. So I just pointed to my eyes. As you can see, it starts, uh, it starts saving a pattern of my irises. Fujitsu tells us that uh, it doesn't matter if you're wearing contact lenses or glasses uh, once you get through the uh, initial setup. Uh, so that's pretty good to, uh, to know uh, because they're also, uh, they're also touting the ability to actually use your phone or unlock your phone even with uh, wet hands or when you have gloves on, uh, which is a bit of a, a letdown with fingerprint sensors because you obviously can't do that, you have to remove them. expect from what we're told you can expect uh, the iris scanner to work from uh, anywhere between 20 and 30 centimeters away from your face uh, and depending on the light uh, you should be able to uh, have the phone uh, pointing uh, upwards as well and it will again pick up your uh, irises uh, from what we were shown uh, the, the response time is really amazing much faster than the fingerprint scanners for sure So now that we're done, it's going to ask for a confirmation. As you can see, it did it real fast. It doesn't need even that. Okay, so yeah. So now that we lock the phone uh, and, and try to unlock it, as you can see, you get a really fast preview up on the top corner of the phone. Uh, it recognizes my eyes and pretty much instantaneously uh, unlocks the phone, which is pretty impressive considering that this isn't even uh, on the market yet. Uh, Fujitsu also told us that this is going to be uh, available with uh, specific apps uh, so you can, uh, for example, they've done a demo with the gallery. Uh, in order to access the gallery I need to uh, show my irises like this and as you can see now I can access my content. So if you have any, pri uh, any private or sensitive information you can actually hide it behind uh, uh, the uh, iris scanner. Uh, so once again this was Chris with Phone Arena with a quick demo of iris scanners.